so hi guys so today um those who are new into solar cell or dssc dissensitized solar cell so today we are going to review a little bit the process what process occur inside the dssc so first of all the important things in the dissensitized solar cell is about the dye molecule itself you can see that here the dye molecule so when the dye molecule undergo oxidation oxidation process we know that oxidation process release an electron so the electron is excited as you can see here the electron is excited from the ground state to the excited state and when the electron is excited it's moved from one TiO2 to another TiO2 as you can see in the photo anode we have a lot of TiO2 nanoparticles so when the electron move from one TiO2 to another TiO2 is create electron hole junction this electron hole junctions will create a voltage because when a junction exists between a hole which is um, a positive and electron negative we got the positive negative positive negative a junction it will create a voltage so what happened then the electron will move to the counter electrode via external circuit as you can see that then the counter electrode acts as a catalyst and uh, to enable the electron to combine with the redox electrolyte that um, in this case the normal redox electrolyte used is iodide triiodide you can see that uh, the electron or the iodide is undergo oxidation the triiodide undergo oxidation to iodide iodide undergo reduction as you can see that the process of redox so what happened that the electron that move to the counter electrode the counter electrode acts as catalyst the electron can combine back with the electrolyte and what happened then the electrolyte the oxidation process that occur in the redox electrolyte give back the electron to give back the electron to the dye and the process occur again again and again it repeat billions time per second and it create an energy because of what because the moving electron carry charge which carry what we call that carry a current and the electron hole junction create a voltage when we are saying about power we learn in physics power is voltage time with current so what we have we have current the moving electron and we have the voltage because of the electron hole junction so we have both criteria to create a new energy which is dye sensitized solar cell power energy which is solar energy that's all. Thank you.